Hey guys, Ralph here, and welcome to True Power Health on this terrific Tuesday here in Connecticut. Life's good, guys. Life's good. That's 250, I'm sorry, 260 kettlebell swings, some snatches, some overhead presses, fueled on juice. I'm gonna knock off a video. I'm gonna do at least another 100. Life's good, man, life's good. Anyway, you saw the thumbnail. Get out of psycho prison, C-I-C-O. Capital C, capital I, capital C, capital O. Calories in, calories out. You might as well say psycho. If you're gonna go there, if you're gonna go there, Listen how I'm breathing. Those kettlebells, man. If you are going to go there, and the calories in, calories out, you are going to be in prison. You're going to be miserable. You are going to be ruled by a completely 100%, 1,000% system that doesn't work. That doesn't work. That nobody knows anything about it. They're just literally making things up. Do you really believe that anybody can tell me how many calories are in this apple? How many calories are in this pear? Let me go back. What is a calorie? A calorie actually stems from math. It's a union of measure used to calibrate energy. It was initially uh, discovered, discovered, formulated, invented, whatever you want to call it, by NASA. Space conglomerate from the federal government as how much energy it took to get a spaceship into non gravity orbit. How much energy it took for it to just be suspended in non gravity, blah, 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 blah. Okay? It is a unit of measure. Okay? Now, unit of measure to calibrate energy. So how does it come in with us? Calorie. How much energy it takes to work off the calories in an apple. So if an apple is 100 calories, they're saying it takes 100 units of measure, 100 calories of energy to work off the calories that are in this apple. Now, like I said at the beginning, the problem is Nobody knows. Nobody knows how many calories are in this. Nobody knows how, how many calories are in this. Nobody knows how many calories are in anything. It's a completely flawed system. How old is this apple? Where was it grown? How long did it send on the, spend on the boat getting over here? Was it in the sun? Was it frozen? Nobody knows. How long was it sitting in the bins in the grocery store? Guys, nobody knows. You can guess, but that's all they're doing is guessing. Nobody knows, okay? Now, as far as your metabolism and how you are going to work off that, nobody knows how much stationary bike you have to do to work off these 100 calories? Nobody knows. You don't know what my met metabolic, uh, my metabolic inferno is. Nobody knows what my metabolism is. I don't know what yours is. Basically, at the end of the day, I don't know what mine is. Guys, we know nothing about calories in, calories out. Now, very, not very often, sometimes, I will go there. Well, my smoothie was 10 bananas, so I do, that's about 1,000 calories. I go there just to speak your language, just to give you some idea of how this is working, okay? But at the end of the day, guys, I, ha I, don't, I don't deal in calories. I don't keep deal in calories at all. Years and years ago, I used to, and I used to get pretty good at it. I could just look at a plate of salad, and that's about 450 calories. I could do that, okay? But then I realized, what's a calorie? No, 
Nobody knows what they're doing. It's a complete and total fraud. It's a flawed system to the max. All right? Now, if we don't know how much... Look, I have a mother that's 92 years old. Okay? She's in an assisted living place. Okay, let's say I go over to her and I take her by the hand and we go outside for a walk. Okay? And we take... I take the exact same step that she does. We have by the hand. Any hill we go up, we do it together. Any hill we go down, any incline. The same air we're breathing. Everything. Okay? Are you trying to tell me that we get through with that 10-minute walk? She burned off the same calories as I did? Of course not. But you go to any, Google it. How many calories do I burn off when I'm running? Well, an 8-minute mile, you burn off spin calories. They don't know. They have no idea about my metabolism. What if I weighed 300 pounds? What if I was a 92-year-old woman? Well, nobody knows what our, their metabolism is. It is, it's not even, it's flawed, guys. And that's just the system itself. Now to try to get, oh my God, I, I, it's only lunch and I'm over my limit of calories. You live like that, not me. You will be miserable. The old saying, Eat less, work out more. The dumbest thing. If you have a, a car, okay, and you want the car to go faster and longer than it ever has been, than it has ever done before, okay, you're going to cut back on the gas? You're going to cut back on the fuel? Of course you're not. It's stupid. It's stupid. You might get some results for a week, 10 days, two weeks. Sooner or later, you're going to bonk. You're going to be miserable. You're going to be fighting because you're, you're, you're it's three o'clock and, and oh my god I, I can't have that I can't have that smoothie I'm dying for a smoothie I made a smoothie for my son when he came home from work and I came home from school oh, I'm dying but I can't you live like that not me I don't restrict any I am never hungry now I restrict what I eat I don't eat meat dairy fish blah 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 but I never go hungry even when I'm cleansing I never go hungry. I just drink more juice until I'm not hungry anymore. Never, never go hungry. Now, calories in, calories out. Guys, these are chock full of vitamins, minerals, nutrients. I am overloading my system with vitamins, minerals, nutrients, and biophotons. Bio Guys, the energy from the sun. It's the way the cells communicate. The biophotons will scoop your IQ up to 20 points. All I do is deluge myself with biophotons. Oh yeah. It's freaking delicious. <laughs> anyway, that's it for today. Don't get into psycho hell. Just don't. Fruits, veggies, juices, throw in some rice corn and some starches if you need it. At the end of the day. Go all day. Just fruits, veggies, and your juices. All day. If you're craving something at night, go ahead and have it. I don't. I don't. I'm full. Now, I, I go off. I've said a zillion times. I go off the fruit and veggie thing. I actually do. But I feel better. I perform better. My mental clarity is better. If... I stick to the fruits and veggies and their juices. No question about it. Stay out of psycho prison. Love you guys. Talk again.